Good afternoon, I'm Brian Reagan. This is Tyler Kelly. And we welcome you to our midday meditation on the Chronicles. Uh, today we're going to take just kind of a quick overview of 2 Chronicles 21, 22, and 23. But Tyler, first go on ahead and read us chapter 21, 18 through the end of the chapter. After all this, the Lord struck him in his intestines with an incurable disease. And then it happened in the course of time after the end of two years. that his intestines came out because of his sickness, so he died in severe pain. And his people made no burning for him like the burning for his fathers. He was 32 years old when he became king. He reigned in Jerusalem eight years, and to no one's sorrow departed. However, they buried him in the city of David, but not in the tombs of the kings. All right, so... Um, <laughs> old song girl don't go away mad girl just go away uh, yeah that that would have been his his song as a king king don't go away mad king just go away um yeah pretty much everything in these three chapters um jehoshaphat dies everything gets bad uh ahaziah's uh, mother athaliah she is a psycho crazy woman mm -hmm. um she tries to kill all of the rest of the royal house of judah but uh jehoshaphat keeps uh joash and hides him and uh until he can he can come of age enough to become king and uh and the priests and, and the military back. Uh, Joash coming in as the king. And uh, Athaliah is put to death. Um, and I mean, fair enough, she cries treason, treason. Because, I mean, fair enough, they are committing treason against her. I mean, she was a crazy psycho woman, but, you know. Uh, but she was a queen for a while. So Israel did have a queen, Queen Athaliah. We don't talk about her too much. And Judah. Yeah, uh, Judah. Okay, Israel, Judah. Yeah, in, yeah. Not the same difference on this, this yeah. point. Yeah, not the same difference, but same difference. You know, I've heard it both ways, all right? In ancient Israel, the southern kingdom had a queen. There you go. And her name was Athaliah. And she was bad. And she was bad. Really bad. And uh, in the northern kingdom had a bad queen, too. Remember what her name was? Jezebel. Jezebel. Yeah, everybody knows her name. Um... But everybody forgets about Athaliah, and Athaliah was equally as bad as Jezebel. Um, just she doesn't get as much press. Um, so, you say, what, what's all the point of all this, brother? Well, the point is, things get pretty bad uh, when you drift away from the Word of God. You don't realize how bad they've gotten until all of a sudden you're in a time of craziness. And then you're like, how do we get here? And how you got here was the drift on one or two or three or four small points. That those that little bit of drift, it's kind of like when you're shooting an azimuth when you're doing land nav for the military. Um, if I'm supposed to be at 132 degrees where I'm going, and I'm at 133 degrees, at 100 yards, it's no big deal. At 100 miles, it's a big deal. It's a big deal. Well, that three or four degrees off doesn't make a big difference on the short run, but as time goes on, boy, cat catastrophe, catastrophe. So, uh, tonight we want to invite you to come back. Uh, our Wednesday night lessons on the Psalms, our hosted, uh, brother is Deacon Greg Edwards. Uh, he's the one hosting the class. He and Brian Reagan, our preacher, are teaching it. And what times, Tyler, and where can they find it? 7 o'clock at the Lake Butler Church of Christ in Lake Butler, Florida, either on our live stream or in person. All right, with that, good afternoon. We'll see you tonight.